The relationship between humans and animals has always been, on some level, tumultuous. From the horrors of selective breeding and negligence with captive animals, to the unending conservation efforts of humanity, the two groups have been in seemingly endless issues with each other. And there's no better way to illustrate this than to look at the ever-shrinking population of the Vaquita. The Vaquita is the smallest marine mammal on Earth, and is only found in an unusually small portion of the northern Gulf of California. This minuscule habitat means the Vaquita has a historically had a small population, one generally around 500, and because of this, the Vaquita isn't selective with what it eats at all, hunting almost anything smaller than it in the area. Also notable is its sociable behavior, and the rare trait amongst porpoises of lacking a beak. Unfortunately, this animal is defined almost entirely by its poor relationship with humans. The area in which it lives is populated with multiple other rare, prized fish, and this habitat means that overfishing, large nets, and other habits dangerous to vaquitas are common in the area. These fisheries have led to the population of vaquitas dropping from an estimate of nearly 600 in the 1900s to less than 10 today. The vaquita is the unfair and unlucky victim of human activity. Recently, conservation efforts have begun, with fishermen not allowed in vaquita territory and normal migratory predators of the vaquita, such as sharks, being excluded from the area. Still, until the vaquita resurges in population and social activity, it will remain the poster child of the cruelty of overfishing and human contact with nature.